Oh, 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 yeah. Hold on. We got one gold one. DJ got like a dark one. Look at Don't let him get in the water. Don't let him get in the water. Fight him out. Fight him out. Fight him out. Three and one pet, man. Insane nice. couple up right here. Let him calm down. Meaty ones. He's like malnourished. Oh. oh. See what I'm saying? Well, he's he got me pretty good on the Hey. What? <laughs> Remember everything I taught you. Dang, he's like snow white right here, bro. Bro, the iguanas out here are white. Bro, there, that is Beautiful. That is a the camera's not really picking it up that well, but in person they're super yeah. white. Special shout outs to FX Air Guns and Paramount Air. Oh my. <laughs> Hyper orange. Oh. Oh. Ooh. <laughs> the finesse. The finesse. <laughs> my goodness. Oh my gosh, definitely six foot. All right, guys, that's what we're going to try to hunt next. A wabbit. And we are back out here at our golf course removal. And the sun is shining. See, I see a big male up in the tree there. And right under him is a brown female. Coming down below, you can see that female. Guys, we are in an insane habitat right now. We've been here before. And we've seen lots of giant iguanas. There's also rabbits out here. We're gonna see if we can find some more. We also have been told that there was a gator, which I believe it. We're out here in Florida, man. Anything is possible. As we learned from last time, they're gonna be hiding in this structure. Keep your eyes peeled. All right, guys, real quick, we have located our first iguanas. They're right on the other side of this bridge. We got Larry and we got Roddy. They're gonna go see if they can give it a shot. All right, guys, we're here with the gang. All right, guys. So, we got our boy here. He's about to go for that one in between the small tree and the coconut tree, right? We have Raj and Roddy going for that one close to the bush. Now go, if you think you got him, go completely this way. Easy, yep. Try to close, yep, yep. There he is. Oh, oh! Okay, 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 okay. Reset. Go, ready, go. He's gonna go. Bend down, go down, crouch down, go, go, go. Go, ready, go. Go on him. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. Stick it through there. Yeah, you feel safer now. Let me T.O., let me T.O. Alright, go. So you got DJ and Hooper over there. They're after that big boy. And let's see if we can put him in the bag. He needs to take his time and focus, get that loop around his head. We believe in you, Hooper. We believe in you, Hooper. <laughs> <laughs> Hooper. Well, I think he's got him pinned. Oh yeah. Guys, it's not as easy as we make it look, guys. These things are strong. And sometimes you put that lasso on them and they just have that much power just to shake it off, you know? They shake it off, guys. They're like little lions. Uh, 
Hooper! You got him. <laughs> He's a white iguana too. Yeah. Is that is that the first one you caught? Or you caught one before? No, this is the second one. This is the second one, my boy. Welcome to the team. You passed the initial <laughs> thing. <laughs> <laughs> well, no, that's cool, dude. I'm so happy for you. Nicely done, Hooper. You the first one, but then you didn't, you didn't give up. You know, you fixed the pole, got right back into it. Yep. My boy. He is pretty white, though, huh? That is a white Yeah, he is. That is a white bucket. That's a beauty. That's a very small head. No neck. Very right. beautiful, though. Good catch, though. Good catch. Nicely done, Hooper. Nicely done. All right, guys. Now it's time to bag the iguana. Woo. All right, what do you see, Marie? It's not a baby. I think one might be hurt. Actually, no, they're stalking. I think because they see people. Silly birds, trying to alert the iguanas. What'd you see, mate? I was looking around, it's a, and I, it looked like a dog walking the bridge, but it's actually a brown male iguana walking the bridge. Go get him. Let's do it. Let's get him. Let's ask him a couple questions. Guys, we're at our golf course job. It's kind of the evening hunt. It's about 4 p.m. So it's the last time for iguanas to get sun. And check that out right there. You guys see that one walking the bridge? Yeah. Oh, there, there's an alpha. There's an alpha. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. Let me get that. Let me get that one. Let me set one right. By itself, yeah, right? solo. He just moved one pole. Right? I know. So the thing that I do, guys, is anytime you see an iguana moving, mm -hmm. you want to think like the iguana. If he's moving and jumping up and down, not like legit jumping, but like going like that, mm -hmm. that means he's either about to move and he's about to go crazy. Look at Raj's movement. Look how he's going outside and then coming in. Look at that. Perfect execution. Look, walked up right wow. in is, is the biggest key on iguanas is you gotta walk around them. Make them think that you have nothing to do. Look at this. 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 Oh, yes. Oh, my God. That's a big one. Bro. That's a big one. <laughs> 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 oh, it doubled up. Holy crap. Oh, my God. That's a big one. Oh, Yo. Man. Hold on. We got one going on. DJ got like a dark one. Look at Come on, DJ. don't let him get in the water. Don't let him get in the water. Fight yeah, him out. Fight him out. Fight him out. Holy smokes. Three and one pet, man. Insane nice. triple up right here. Let him calm down. Yep. He's doing fine, man. Remember everything I taught you. Dang, he's like snow white right here, bro. Dude. Bro, the iguanas out here are white. Bro, there, that is beautiful. That is a The thick. camera's not really picking it up that well, but in person, they're super yeah. white. No, we'll get, we'll get, let me get the other camera out. Yeah. Let's get a cameo. Put three. Oh, man. Real nice. Thank you. I like the man on Come this here. one. Come here. Come here. Come here. Dude, that's awesome. Incredible, guys. We're at our golf course job. Three piece at the golf course. Seen it right there, y'all. The sun's about to go down in about an hour and a half. We just landed three monster iguanas. <laughs> one last thing to do. Time to Put them in, in the bag. In the bag. Last one. Bye. You see that branch in front of that branch? There's another branch. Right out the bush. Oh. <laughs> there we go. 
Oh snap! Yeah, this one's spicy. Oh, shoot. oh, there's another one. Oh, 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 oh my god. He's swinging that tail like a baseball bat. Dude, this one's super feisty. It's like a black dragon. Dude. What happened? Dude. Oh. There was a giant here. There was a giant. There was a chance. Dude. Right there. Is that a bird? Sounds like a monster living in this tree. You know what I think it is? It's the thickness of the brush. That and it's another uh, female right there too. See, there's probably like 30, there's a bunch of them right there. Like 20 females. Look at that big. They're all hey. just on that one branch. Mm -hmm. We're holding this iguana, and they're all those iguanas are looking right at us right now. All of them. We just took penalizing what we're doing. We just took their cousin. Wow. All right. Well, we now we know a new spot to bring the air rifle and probably bring back Rambo out here, y'all. Yeah. It's literally trying to fight, trying to stay on a branch. Really. directly through the canopy. There are some monster iguanas. Unfortunately, right now, we just have catch poles. All, all my air rifles are being serviced for the new year. I have no rifles with me right now. They will be here soon. Anyways, we got some more areas to check. So without any further ado. Wait, what? Oh. Wait, hold on. Oh, Marie, this is all you, Marie. Yeah, yeah. This is all you. Oh. Hey, just an FYI on that one. I'm not sure if somebody heard him. Yeah. Because he's sick, or I'm not really even sure. Oh. Yeah, well, look what he's doing, you know? It's like, I've never oh. seen him do that. Yeah. Nerve damage most likely well, after being frozen. Seen, he looks very thin, also. Yeah, I like the meaty ones. He's like nurse. Oh, see what I'm saying? Look. You think anyone could have accidentally ran him over? That's what I'm thinking. And his swollen eye right there, and the way he's acting, it seems like he has something. We got hit in his head. His orbital right there. Really. Oh, good grab. It's a Sheila. Oh, wait, come she's on. just sitting there, dude. Sitting she's there not too? even that cold. She's not? No. She's not. She's actually really warm. We're going to run back right now. We're only staying for two more minutes. You see any more? This is a weird one. She feels like a decent temperature. She doesn't, she's not cold at all. But I just literally walked up on her. She we had eye contact the whole time. And she did nothing. She just laid there. Maybe like her body's warm, but her, like her heart's not up to beat. Oh. So you see the big orange one high there? There's a giant one in the crevice. Then you got one, two, three, four, four Sheila's at the edge. Dude, this whole tree is just probably loaded, dude. And look, he the alpha's at the entrance of the bark of the tree where these females are laying at. So he's technically protecting them. Wow. And then he's just he's there by himself at the corner. Nobody can come in or come out without his permission. Guys, I don't know if you guys can see him. But on the peak of that plant line, by the water bank, that's a rabbit, guys. That's not a squirrel. Some of you may say that's a squirrel. That's actually a bunny rabbit. That ain't no squirrel I've seen before. Apparently there's an alligator here as well. As you guys can see from the background, the sun is starting to set and we do need to get back. Double back to our truck and we're gonna see what else we can catch. So follow me. Whew. Out here at our golf course removal job. As you guys see, we got a lot of iguanas. Uh, we did see some bunnies. We did see a lot more in nest. We will be back here probably a couple times a week. So if you guys wanna see that, subscribe with the bell on, go ahead, put that in there. 
Also, make sure you guys subscribe to Red Sport Fishing and also the Iguana Ninja on YouTube, all right? The man himself, the Za Ninja. Welcome back. It's a new year. It's not welcome back. He never went anywhere. He never left. He never left. <laughs> never did. There's slow seasons, there's high seasons, and right? I ain't going nowhere. Right now, it's about to be the egg season. This is going to be the highest season of the year. It's exciting. Why do you think me and the Iguana Ninja have been taking vacations, y'all? We're resting up. Because once it's egg season, it's all day, every day. Well, it's for like three months straight, back to back every day. <laughs> but you get the idea. We're gonna be busy guys and we gotta make sure we're rested up. So make sure you exactly. subscribe to all the guys and make sure you guys like this video as well. We got a bag full of iguanas. Woo! Comment down some recipes if you guys wanna see us do a catch and cook. Peace. Right here actually. See what they're doing guys. They're all just foraging through this grass. Seen that before? Never seen that before. Seen wild bunnies before? No, never seen wild bunnies. Seen white iguanas before? Never. Never. Seeing things and learning things for our very first time out here in Florida. So if you want to keep seeing and keep learning, just subscribe to all three of us.